Hey guys, it's Chris here on Halo Follower, and today we have some really exciting news involving Halo 6, potentially, the Halo TV show, maybe, I'm thinking, and Halo lore. We got new Halo lore coming our way on June 6, very close to E3, mind you. So here's my theory. This is a new comic book. This isn't a theory, this is news. Halo Collateral Damage, it is a Master Chief story. Now, here's my theory. I'm thinking that this might be maybe a teaser of some sort, something tying in with the Halo TV show, if not a comic book version of the TV show. We still have no freaking idea what it's gonna be about, but a few days ago, I reported as it was stated on a Showtime CEO stated that the Halo TV show may begin filming this fall, here in 2018. Now, uh, E3 2018 takes place on June 12th to June 14th. This comic book goes on sale, the first part of it goes on sale on June 6, 2018, about a week before E3, and we just heard just a couple days ago that, you know, just a couple days before this was announced, this comic book was announced, fantastic art here by the way, that we will be getting this comic book. So what is it about? What may the TV show be about? And how may it tie into Halo 6? Well, let's get into it. Halo Collateral Damage follows the Master Chief and Blue Team as they are deployed by the UNSC to an unstable colony world. Their mission is to terminate the Covenant's efforts to uncover something ancient and powerful beneath the planet's surface. Hmm, what is that, I wonder? We're going to get into that in just a moment. However, as the mission takes a turn for the unexpected, the Spartan 2 strike team realizes that the stakes of their mission are higher than they imagined, and they'll have to rely on each other and a small group of human rebels to survive. So this sounds really, really cool. I really like the idea of it. Now, it is a mini, bo a mini comic book series, so don't expect too much out of it. You know, it might just be 10, 20, 30 pages long. Who knows? But nonetheless, it does drop on June 6th, and I'm definitely going to do some review of it, and I'm really excited to see what this comic book adds to the lore. But how does it tie into Halo 6? How does it tie into the Halo TV show? Well, this, what I just read, might actually be the TV show itself. It might have some sort of... I don't know, going back of Master Chief, kind of him going through trials and tribulations and kind of realizing who he is and who he isn't and maybe realizing his humanity, maybe. Now, that would be really cool because I think that's relatable for everybody, you know, and, and everybody can kind of get that. And that's a really cool way of making something that is so sci-fi, so fantasy into something that's grounded, something that's emotional that us here in the 21st century can kind of understand. Um, they also say that their mission is to terminate the Covenant's efforts to uncover something ancient and powerful beneath the planet's surface. Yeah, this would also be a really great way to introduce foreigner technology for those that don't really quite, you know, have a grasp on Halo yet. If they did this with the Halo TV show, with a comic book series, I think they should go all in because only us Halo nerds that watch this stuff like crazy are going to be watching or reading, rather, a comic book, I think. Although I could be completely wrong about that, but... Uh, this is really exciting because I think that the technology that they are finding here is maybe a guardian. And I think that would be really cool to see us realize and to experience along with Master Chief and Blue Team a guardian for the first time. You know, we have the guardians, you know, taking control of the galaxy in Halo 5 at the very end and most likely Halo 6 knocking out tons of colonies and Kilios, Earth, the Soul System and so many more. So it would be really cool for us to kind of understand what these constructs are and what they're capable of doing. And that would be a lot of <laughs> speculation ammo for Halo 6. I, if there is a guardian this, we can maybe see some stuff that might actually happen in Halo 6. And we can see what Master Chief may learn about these constructs. And yeah, I mean, I just want to know more about them. I mean, Halo 5 had a subtitle, Halo 5 Guardians, you know, and I feel like we didn't really know or we haven't learned very much about them. Is that bad writing? Who knows? But they can make up for it. And that's what a lot of comic books and books in general do is they kind of fill the plot holes and 
kind of come back with second thoughts about everything. So yeah, I really hope that they kind of fill in some of the gaps in Halo 5 here. I hope they kind of make sense of the world that we are moving into. Yeah, I'm really excited to learn more about the foreigners and whatnot in the Guardians. But guys, let me know what do you think is powerful and ancient beneath this planet's surface? You know, so many, I'm just going to say one more thing, so many uh, Guardians risen up from colony worlds. I think that it isn't completely out of question. So, but I do want to hear what you think down in the comment section below. Do you think it's a guardian or something else? Why and how? I want to know down in the comments. And guys, if you enjoyed this video, then be sure to drop it a like and subscribe here on Halo Follower for all of your Halo needs and desires and fantasies. Wink, wink. Come and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.